Richard Dick Edman is an American actor and occasional director. He has appeared in more than 160 film and television productions since 1944, mostly in supporting roles. Early life and career, Edman was born John Richard Edman in Enid in northern Oklahoma. He played in his first film Mr. Skeffington with Bette Davis and Claude Rains in 1944. Edman started his career at Warner Brothers, where he gained a studio contract. After a few smaller roles he achieved success as a character actor in supporting roles, often playing characters who were much older than he actually was. In a career that has spanned seven decades, his best-known roles are that of the barracks chief Hoffy in Stalag 17, and McNulty in the classic Twilight Zone episode A Kind of a Stopwatch. He also appeared in The Men with Marlon Brando and the film Noir Cry Danger with Dick Powell. In Tora 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 he played Colonel Edward F. French, the officer who responded to the failure to transmit the warning to Pearl Harbor, Hawaii. From 1953 to 1954. Edman also co-starred with Ray Bogger in the ABC sitcom, Where's Raymond? Edman was cast as the pessimistic Pete Morizzi, Ray's landlord and press agent. In 1956, he was cast in the episode Man on the Totem Pole of the religion anthology series, Crossroads. Edman appeared as Black Mailer and murder victim Arthur Binney in the Perry Mason first season television episode, The Case of the Gilded Lily which aired on CBS on May 24, 1958. During the nine-year run of Perry Mason, he appeared in five other episodes, often cast as the actual murderer, such as Charles Montrose in the 1962 episode, The Case of the Absent Artist, Harry Niles in the 1964 episode, The Case of the Antic Angel, and Judd Bennett in the 1966 episode, The Case of the Vanishing Victim. He appeared as Sergeant Jasper in Walt Disney's miniseries The Swamp Fox. From 1960 to 1961, Edman was a regular in 32 episodes of NBC's single-season sitcom, The Tab Hunter Show, having been cast in the role of the wealthy Richard Fairchild, three. In 1962, Edman had a recurring role as Cluggy, the photographer, in 14 episodes of the NBC drama series, Saints and Sinners the cast of which included Nick Adams. In 1965, he played Colonel Milbank in the episode The Black Box of CBS's Petticoat Junction, a rural sitcom starring B. Bernarderit and Edgar Buchanan. That same year, he was cast comically as Buck Brown, a Broadway wardrobe man, on CBS's The Dick Van Dyke Show. He also directed the 1971 TV film Mooch Goes to Hollywood. In 1977, Edman appeared in The Bionic Woman. From 1978 to 1982, he appeared in four episodes of CBS's Lou Grant, starring Ed Osner. In two of those segments he was cast as Hal Hanecker. In 1986, he appeared as Duncan Fitzgerald on Cheers in the episode Money Dearest, playing a wealthy widower who becomes engaged to Cliff Clavin's mother Esther. In 1990, Edman appeared as Howard Banks on Wings in the episode Around the World in 80 Years. Since 2009, Edman has a recurring role as the old student Leonard Rodriguez on Community. Personal life, Edman married fellow actress Lisa Holland in 1948, but they divorced two years later. He has been married to his second wife, Sharon, since 1953. They had one daughter, Erica who was born in 1954 and died in 2010 of an accidental overdose of prescription medicine. Erica was a poet and illustrator and the author of one full-length collection of poems. Selected filmography. Equals film appearances equals. Equals television appearances equals. Equals Richard Edman as a director equals. The Dick Van Dyke Show. Teenage Tees. Mooch Goes to Hollywood. The Brothers O'Toole. See also. References. External links. Richard Edman at the Internet Movie Database.